Welcome to Migrant Bird Space here at Physicians Berlin. My name is Eva. I'm uh, the curatorial director of Migrant Bird Space. And here at Positions, we are presenting two young Chinese artists. It's all about Chinese femininity. The first artist that we are presenting is Lo Yang. She's quite well acclaimed already in Europe and she's very well known for her girl series, part of which we are showing here at our booth. She has started this series in 2008 and it's all about individuality. Her models are girls, young women, part of whom are her friends or even people that she met on the street. She encourages them to really uh, show themselves as they feel and how they are. So it's all about expression of individuality. Aside of the fact that uh, these images are very beautiful and very aesthetic, we found it was really interesting that the cultural context in which these women present themselves does not necessarily encourage individuality. So the way these women are represented here is quite unusual, especially for Chinese circumstances. And it's very open-hearted at the same time. It's also quite clear that some of these images are so open, even of erotic nature, that we will probably not be able to show them in China. Luo Yang would never conceive of herself as a political artist or even a feminist. She would always emphasize that this is all about individuality, about a personal connection with her models, and it's not about transporting a feminist or even political message. The second female position that we're showing here at the fair is Ya Fei Qi, young performance artist and also a painter from China. And she is well known because she has just had a residency from the Federal Foreign Office here in Berlin. The video work that we are showing here is called I Wonder Why. She did this in 2017 and it's a performance. The story behind it is that she just broke up with her long-term boyfriend back then, so she had been with him for more than 10 years. So her family and friends and everyone around her actually expected her to get married and not break up with him. The content that um, Yafei is trying to convey here is how Chinese society punishes a female betrayer. Uh, so we see friends of hers actually slapping Yafei across the face and uh, during the course of this about five minute video you see her face changing and real authentic emotion coming up. We are not only presenting video works, we are also presenting paintings by Yafei Qi, all of whom are of abstract nature, so we never see any faces. Sometimes even limbs are cut off. It's uh, very different what we see here. So this large red painting over here, we see a young boy actually that is being um, portrayed here. He is also from Yafei's circle of friends. She always works with her family and friends. The question actually came up, so why doesn't she show the feet here might be because uh, you know this person lost ground literally um, and uh, she also makes a point of not showing any faces in her portraits because the way she wants her paintings to be conceived is as a transportation of emotions and not of particular personalities.